another finally finally of the this entire year finally reacting to a video and it's a little bit different because we if y'all hit me freaking three likes or four likes i will drop the another banger now to uh, the rest of 2019 2020 that the tour virus is about to get ended but now got another shit going on is an ant spoilers but y'all don't know what type of ant so so make sure you subscribe, comment, like, we're almost hitting at 30 subscribers. Hit that subscribe button, and we're about to get to 30 subscribers. Hit that subscribe button, if you, and help to support this channel and stuff. Know what I'm saying. So, 3, 2, 1. Man, wait, 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 before I start the, uh, before I start the video, I mean, need y'all to go to my YouTube channel, and then go to my channel. So I don't even know how I get the channel, though. If I get, okay, so now. And YouTube, do not hate to shoot these, these videos, please. I need this. I need this job. Because when I get older, I need this job. Alright. But, um, what I'm saying is that I'm going to need y'all to go to my channels. And then if you see my brother, Gamer Yabby L, he got six subscribers. And then, yeah. And then my other brother is Edwin. You're going to have to find if the background of his is a, it's a gray ball. And... It's a L, well, a white L, and that's how you're gonna get to subscribe to his channel and get more content and stuff. And uh, then yeah, so support this channel, support their channels, and support other people's channel if you really want to subscribe, comment, like, and we're about to get to 30 subscribers. Click hitting that bell, and if I get three subscribe, no, if I get freaking four likes, I'ma drop another banger. So let three, two, one, click clack. We're back. Doesn't matter to the ants. They're going to attack with full 
force. Ah, ah. Number five. How painful is the sting of this ant? Well, like all ants, they are capable of biting and stinging. And while the bite doesn't have any venom, it allows the ant to hold on while it inflicts the stings. On the insect sting pain index, the fire ant only ranks as a two. It's got some kick, but the pain isn't so much from a single sting as it is the onslaught of stings. Now, when I plunged my hands into a volcano of ants, I was stung over 300 times. Yeah, it definitely hurts. Number six, will volcano ants sting humans for absolutely no reason? I don't say this often, but the answer is yes. For some reason, these ants are exceptionally angry. Although in fairness to the ants, most mass stingings come as a result of their homes being disturbed. So, I guess if it was your family that was being stomped on, you'd probably defend it too. Number seven, what's worse, the sting or the aftermath? With this one, it is definitely the aftermath. The venom is very potent and contains water-insoluble pepperdine alkaloids known as solnopsins. When the ant stings and injects venom, your body isolates it into pockets beneath the skin. These pockets then swell to the surface and form disgusting white pustules, which can remain for several days, if not weeks. Trust me, they're incredibly insightful. Oh my god. Alright guys, I hope he doesn't call me. And when I was stung 300 times, it looked like my hands and arms had the worst case of acne you have ever seen. Number 8. Do people get stung frequently? Unfortunately, yes. Around 14 million people experience the sting of fire ants yearly because they are commonly found in urban areas. Some people have or develop a very bad allergic reaction to the venom. And to date, more than 80 deaths have been recorded as a result of fire ant attacks. Number nine, should we be afraid of volcano ants this summer? Honestly, not necessarily. Remember, these insects are not out to get you. They don't eat humans, but their aggressive nature makes them very prone to attacking. The best way to avoid them is to stay in tune with your environment. Watch where you're walking. Don't poke unassuming mounds of dirt. And if you're headed out for a picnic, pay attention to where you set your blanket down. The last thing you want is a swarm of volcano ants running up your pants. Number 10. Can human pee really cure the burning sensation of fire ant stings? Well, it's fair to say that I definitely tried, and it kind of worked. When I dumped pee, yes, my own pee, all of my hands, certain enzymes in the urine, like ammonia and potassium, help neutralize and soothe the stinging sensation. In fact, it pretty much eliminated the pain altogether. However, the end result did not stop me from getting those nasty white pustules, which, like I said earlier, were definitely the worst part of the entire experience. In the end, volcano ants aren't something you necessarily need to be afraid of. They're something you need to be aware of, because these insects have invaded the United States and are definitely here to stay. Huh. And trust me, the last thing you want to have to deal with at a summer picnic is peeing on yourself or a friend to stop the burning sting of volcano ants. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next adventure. Mr. Peterson. Mr. Peterson. Here's some fresh warm pee you requested. I didn't request any pee. It's my pee. Another bug here. I got a little bit freaky. Like, not like that. I got, like, scared when he said New Zealand. But somehow, reason I don't like New Zealand. I really don't know why, but I haven't been there. But it feels like I don't... It's like... It's just like... I don't know. Like... Hey. People at New Zealand... But yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe, comment, like, and then we're gonna get more content. We're gonna get more content. Um.
yeah, so yeah, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe, comment, like, and see you, Nate. See you later. Peace.